professional volleyball league coming uh, to the yeah. United States. You just wrapped up your your rookie season in in Puerto Rico. But what does it mean to to come back back home to the Midwest? I'm literally beyond excited. I think that the fact that Kathy is a coach too just makes it even more special for me because we both went to Mother Macaulay High School. And so we bonded over that in the recruiting process. And I just felt like an instant draw to her. And like, it's just so exciting that volleyball will be pay- played in the United States. I mean, I love volleyball and I've been playing since I was 12 and have played at a very, very high level. But a huge deterrent for me was you have to go so far and leave behind like so much of your life. So like, I'm just so excited to like have it at home like my family can come and visit because I've never been this close to home I've been in Missouri and Nebraska and Texas like and this is only like a two and a half hour drive from home so like I'm literally in my backyard I feel like so I'm just beyond excited and you mentioned having a, a connection with Kathy George already you guys went to the same high school um given that it's a a new league and this is something that really hasn't been done before was the recruiting process unique in that sense it was very similar to college, I would say. Like, she just called me up. She's like, hey, like, actually, she sent the text first. And then she called me up. She's like, hey, like, do you have any entrance in this? Like, and it was just like college. Like, they asked you, like, a little bit about yourself. And that's how we found out we went to the same high school. I think she already knew that about me. But, like, I didn't know that about her. And I was like, oh, my God, no way. Like, so, yeah, it was really similar. And I'm just, like, so excited. Like, this is so unique and just so cool. Did you get recruited by any of the other teams or was Grand Rapids uh, the only one? So Grand Rapids was actually first. They were on it, but I did have the Nebraska franchise reach out to me and the Atlanta franchise reach out to me. And so the Nebraska one was a little tough because obviously like I went to Nebraska and I loved it there, but I'm just like beyond excited to like be in Grand Rapids. The community seems amazing already. Like we have some awesome players on our team. Kathy's amazing. I can't say enough good things about her. Like she's so cool, but. Yeah, I'm so excited. What was your experience like uh, playing in Puerto Rico? That was amazing. Like, it was so fun. Like, literally, like, practices were always in the evening. So, like, during the day, you could get your lift done. You could go to the beach, like, whatever you want. It was so cool. And just, like, the competition there is, like, really, like, it's fun and it's different. But it's also super light, too. Like, they have, like, live music that they're playing in the stands. Like, it was just so fun. Very different than home. And. I really appreciated that experience as well. For sure. And I think this this league is is so cool in the sense that, you know, for young volleyball players, and especially maybe in the time when we were growing up, the only women that there were to look up to were primarily at the Olympic level. And I think it was before yeah. college volleyball um, really started to come up and, and be to where it's at right now. Um, how cool do you think this is going to be for the next generation of volleyball players? I literally just got chills when you asked me that question because I think it's going to be insanely cool. Like a lot of like your favorite college players are now coming together to be on the same team. Like I saw that the Wisconsin team signed some of the, I mean, the Nebraska team signed some of the Wisconsin players. And I just thought that was so funny that now the Nebraska fans are going to be rallying around the Wisconsin people. And it's like all that talent coming together. We have great talent here at home. And like the fact that we're going to all be able to play together is just so cool. Like this is about to be so sick. For sure. And you're no stranger to high level volleyball. Obviously you played at Nebraska. That's a volleyball powerhouse. And then went to Texas where you won a a national championship. How did that prepare you now for this opportunity to continue your career professionally? Yeah, I feel like very well prepared. I feel like I have like really a good basis of training like my foundation and like I can always just relate back to that like I feel like anything now it won't be too much of a shock or anything different like and especially since like Kathy is a collegiate coach like I can expect the same things like going through her training and things like that so I think I've been well prepared just because I've played at the top level and had some of that best training from some of the really greatest coaches like in I don't know the world (laughs) 